Governor Mark Dayton says a legislative vote on a Minnesota Vikings stadium package is jeopardized by lingering concerns about sites and how to pay for it. The Democrat did not pick a preferred site today, but said competing plans in Minneapolis and Arden Hills are currently inadequate. The legislature convenes next week and the fate of a new Viking stadium is expected to dominate. Some legislators would prefer to vote, postpone final action until 2013 because they want to avoid taking a tough vote on a controversial project before next November's election. The inability of stadium proponents to complete their own preparations gives cover to that delay. Quote, we can't vote because we don't have a specific proposal, close quote, has been the consistent and legitimate refrain of those wishing to avoid a vote. The team's Metrodome lease expired at the end of the just concluded season. Dayton says the Arden Hills plan has been stymied by concerns about new taxes and whether a voter referendum would be required. He says two Minneapolis sites lack full vetting or wouldn't provide enough return on investment. Dayton expressed optimism, though, the stadium issue could be resolved quickly if the questions are answered. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.